Hello my friend, this is Matt from Best Friends Club, and in this video I'm going to show you how you can effortlessly extract vocal stems from any recording using only an app on your phone, no matter what other sounds or noises are in that original recording. This way you can have super clean voice and vocal recordings that you can use in your projects. You'll be able to impress others with your professional sounding voice and vocal recordings. And most of all, you'll have the freedom to do this work anywhere you want to because you'll be able to use it simply using an app on your phone. Thankfully, it is actually super simple to do. There are only three steps. All you have to do is open up the app, load up the audio file that you want to use, and then choose one of the different AI algorithms that you want that is most appropriate for the audio recording, whether it's you're separating vocals from an instrumental, or vocals from noise, individual instruments, whichever it may be. But before we jump in, the first thing you're going to want to do is actually get the app. We're going to be using the Lala AI vocal remover app. So head over to lala.ai to grab it or head over to the link in the description. There will be a link to the app store so you can download it for your iPhone and get started. The audio that we'll be using to extract vocals from in this particular example is from a video that I took at a beach party that I was throwing in Vancouver, Canada. It was a pretty fun time. A bunch of ATV cops actually broke it up at the end of the night. We didn't get any find at all. They actually were really chill cops. With that said, let's take a look at this video and pay attention to the audio so that we can see what we'll be extracting the vocal from all the background noise, there's speakers and people everywhere and all that kind of stuff. And we'll be able to actually use that and extract the vocal from that. So let's take a look at this. Hey, this is Matt from Best Friends Club. I'm in Vancouver. We're playing a cool party called Tumblr. And hopefully my voice is separating cool right now, even though we have some massive speakers popping. Sweet. So in that video, you can hear my voice is there and there is a bunch of background noise going on because we were throwing a pretty cool party. So what we're going to do now is we're going to use the Lala app right now to extract my voice from the rest of all of that. So the very first thing that we're going to want to do is choose the audio. So what you're going to want to do is press this yellow split files button and you're going to have the option to choose uh, something from your files section in the iPhone or you can go to your photo library as well and check. In this example, we're going to click choose files and we're going to navigate over to the actual audio file. So what I did was I ran a little script which would change the video to audio. If you want to look that up, there are some great tutorials online on how to do that. But for this example, what we'll do is actually click the audio that we want to extract, which is right here. And we're going to want to press open. The very next thing that we're going to want to do once we have our file selected is we're going to want to choose which kind of algorithm we're going to want to apply to best separate the vocal from the rest of the sound. So there's a bunch of options, vocal and instrumental, vocal, voice and noise. You can extract drums, bass, acoustic guitar, electric guitar, piano, synthesizer, string, wind. There's a bunch of different algorithms you can choose depending on your audio source. I think in this example, what we're going to do is voice and noise. So we'll go ahead and select that. And then we're going to press start processing. So now what's going to happen is this file, the audio file is going to upload to Lalal, and from there, it's going to do all the processing and get the, the audio file ready. What you're going to want to do is wait a little while. It can take a bit of time to process. There's some magic going on here, so just give it a few moments to process. Once it's done, it'll change how it looks. It'll look a little bit like this. What you're going to want to do is tap on the three dots and press process the entire file. What it's going to do is then actually run the AI magic and separate everything. It'll kind of change how it looks again. It'll turn, the icon will turn yellow and you can actually tap it to open up. And now we can actually listen to the two separated files. So let's go ahead and listen to those. First, we'll start off with the isolated voice. Hey, this is Matt from Best Friends Club. I'm in Vancouver. We're playing a cool party called Tumblr. Hopefully my voice is separating cool right now. That's popping. Cool, so that was the voice separated. A little bit is coming through, but it's quite a difference. So now let's go ahead and just listen to the noise by itself. Very cool. So you can hear there that it's just kind of all the noise from the speakers and all the people at the beach and all that. They're separated quite well. It's pretty useful. This is pretty neat. So from there, there's a couple things that you can do. First, you can obviously play each of the individually separated tracks right here. You can also click on the folder icon of either of these to show where it is in the actual folder. And that way you have access to the files. You can click on them, share them, do whatever you'd like to do with them. You can also click the three dots, whether it's open or closed. And you have a couple options here. 
again, you can show in files if you'd like to, just from those three dots. Also going back, you can share directly from here as well. So if you click, click the three dots, press share, you'll be able to uh, airdrop it to yourself, send it to an email, send it to a text, whatever you're going to want to do. And of course, you can also click the three dots and delete this project from the app as well if you'd like to. Also, in addition to this, you should know that each time you extract any audio using Lala, it's going to use a bank of minutes to do this. So if you need to add any vocal extraction minutes to your profile, you can also tap your profile icon on the top right here. And over here, there's a bunch of extra information that you can have. But the main thing is you'd want to press buy minutes and go ahead and select which option is the best for you. And that really is how you can super, super easily extract vocals or other stems that you want to from your audio recordings directly from your phone. You don't need to record it on your phone or have it on your phone and then email it to yourself or any of that kind of annoying stuff. With the Lala app, you can actually do it directly from your phone. It's just a couple of steps and it's done just like that. Now, there are a bunch of different reasons you might have an audio file on your phone that you want to do some vocal separation for. You might have a noisy recording. You might have filmed something and created a video and then after playing back that video, notice there's something cool in there that you'd like to sample. You might be recording on the go vocal ideas that actually sound pretty good, but have a bunch of background noise. You might be recording your band rehearsals and want to take those to the next level. Maybe you don't have access to a computer and you, all you have access to is a phone or for whatever reason, there is an audio file on your phone that you want to extract the stems from and you don't want to go through the hassle of sending it over to your computer, emailing it to you, all that kind of stuff. So that you could do it on the computer you just want to kind of get it done quickly on your phone so with that said if you want to download the app right now it is available for ios there'll be a link to it in the description below if you do enjoy the app make sure to give it five stars and if you'd like to learn more about the ai magic that goes behind this app be sure to check out lola.ai where you can learn a lot more about all this stuff that you can even do it on the desktop if you'd like to and there'll be links of course to be able to download it on your iphone so with that said, have fun extracting your audio. If you found this video useful, like and subscribe and all that good stuff. And I'll see you in the next video, my friend. Have a good one.